Dozens of Israeli settlers torched several homes and cars in a Palestinian town in the West Bank, firing bullets and tear gas at residents, drawing widespread condemnation from Israeli leaders and the U.S. The riot in the village of Jet killed a 23-year-old Palestinian man and critically injured others. Witnesses say at least 100 mass settlers raided the village. Israeli defense forces showed up to disperse the attackers, who threw rocks and Molotov cocktails before being stopped. One person was taken into custody for questioning, and Israel's security agency and police announced a joint investigation into the attack. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu vowed the attackers would be apprehended and tried. Israel's interior minister called the riots a serious nationalist crime, and Israeli President Isaac Herzog demanded police swiftly bring those responsible to justice. The White House called the incident unacceptable. A similar attack by settlers on a Palestinian village in April went without the same condemnation by Israel as the one in Jet. Violence across the region is up since the October 7th terror attack by Hamas and Israel. With the UN reporting nearly 1,200 Israeli settler attacks from October 7th to August 5th. 114 of those attacks reportedly led to Palestinian deaths and injuries. For more updates to this story, download the Straight Arrow News app or visit san.com.